Hey, this is Ryan Dice, and I wanted to make a quick video for you about banner ads, of all things. Uh, I mentioned in the letter about the wholesale traffic system that one of the things that we're going to be teaching is how to buy banner ads at wholesale prices. And a, little, a few people were surprised about that. We actually got a number of emails in from folks, um, even people who, are, who had already invested in the system who were like, you know, what, what's, I'm looking forward to that, or what's that all about? Uh, I thought banner ads were dead. I thought they, they really didn't work anymore. Um, I'm here to tell you that banner ads absolutely positively do work. In fact, if you watch the Mr. X video, you saw in there how I, uh, I, I mentioned that I, hadn't, I didn't give, give Google any money for about a year. So I didn't do anything with AdWords for about a year after the Google slap. And the way that I generated my traffic after that happened was I got very, very good at banner advertising and buying banner ads really inexpensively. And one of the, I'm just going to show you real quick more what not to do. I'm going to, I'm going to show you kind of how we go, you know, one of the ways that I go about buying banner ads. But the big thing that I want to show you here is what not to do if you want to buy them at wholesale prices. Because what a lot of people do when it comes to buying banner ads, if they want to give it a shot, they'll go to some of the big banner ad networks such as Cassell Media, which is this site right here, uh, and BlueLithium.com. Those are just two of some of the really big banner ad aggregators. And so what these sites do is they partner with you know hundreds and thousands of other websites and they will use their, you know, they, they get their data so they understand demographically speaking what kind of traffic is coming to those websites on a regular basis and you tell them, okay, I have a Forex offer or I have a weight loss offer or I have a dog training offer, whatever your offer is, they will, they will make suggestions like we're going to put you in this channel, we're going to put you on all these different sites. It sounds great, right? And it is great if you've got a big chunk of money to spend. I mean, if you've got a, a 10000 20000 $100,000 ad budget, then I absolutely recommend that you go with one of these big aggregators. Their data is fantastic. They can actually drill down for you really, really well and get you some pretty dang good traffic. Um, if you don't have big money to spend though, and I, I realize that a lot of people watching this video don't, that's the reason you're interested in getting traffic at wholesale prices, then you don't want to go through these big aggregators because the only way to get any kind of discount, the only way to buy traffic wholesale is to buy in bulk. And that's one of the things that we're very big about with the wholesale traffic system is being able to get traffic at dirt cheap costs without having to spend a lot of money, without having to buy in bulk. I mean, anybody can just show up, throw a whole lot of money at somebody and get some discounts, right? But we want to get a little bit creative and find some ways to, um, to, to get traffic without having to, to buy in bulk. So let me show you how I go about buying banner ad traffic. And let's say, for example... Yeah, those of you who know me and are familiar with that business know I do a lot in the Forex market. So let's say I, I really want to uh, rank well or I'd like to have a banner ad on sites that deal with something as specific as, let's say, Forex trend trading, right? Because what a lot of people want to do is they'll type in generic keywords like Forex. You can do that, but you're going to come up with very generic sites that either don't sell banner advertising like this one, or if they do sell banner advertising, it's going to cost you a fortune. So you want to drill down, all right? The secret to buying banner advertising at wholesale prices is to really drill down in your market. So let's say that I've got a particular report. Maybe it's a self-liquidating offer. Um, you know, maybe it's 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 a, a different ebook on a on, you know on a different product that I've really splintered. I've, I've used the product splintering model. But let's say it's on it's on forex trend trading. Okay. Now, here are some websites that deal specifically with Forex trend trading. In fact, if I wanted to be ranked number one for the keyword term Forex trend trading, I can guarantee you that that would be difficult. I mean, there's 189,000 competing sites. It's a really competitive keyword. The Forex market in particular is a very competitive marketplace. But look, here's a website right here that does, in fact, accept banner advertising. There's a banner ad right there. There's a banner ad over here, banner ad up top. And, you know, I know with this particular website, they've even got a pop-up right there that appears. Um, so I know with this particular website that they do accept advertising. Now, you know, this website may still be too expensive, but what you can do is you can go down to the bottom and let's see if they have it. Yep, sure enough, right here. Advertise on Investopedia. So you can go right here. You can... 
email them. Actually, they, they just pop up right here with their media kit. So you can request the media kit or email them for it, and it'll tell you what it costs, and then you can enter into the negotiations. We're going to talk about how to do some negotiations inside the wholesale traffic system, but you know, this is the way, oops, sorry, this is the way that I buy banner ads. I don't go to the big networks. I go to individual sites where I want my ads to appear. Now, another big secret, and I, you know, this is a huge secret. So, if for some reason you weren't paying attention before, highly recommend you do it right now. Blogs. I love buying traffic on, on blogs. So, I typed in Forex Trend Trading blog. And see, here we've got a blog. Now, let's just see. I haven't checked this ahead of time. Let's see if they're accepting any advertising. And yep, sure enough, here's a banner ad right here on this blog. The great thing about blogs is that most blogs are pretty inexpensive to buy banner advertising for, all right? But they get a lot of traffic and they get really good traffic. Let's check out this one. Yep, here's an ad right here up top on this one. Now, you want to make sure that it's not a garbage blog, that, that they actually have some good content because the, the good thing about blogs is it's people coming back over and over and over again who are interested in getting this content. So. If there's a recommendation on a blog for a particular product or service, people are going to be far more likely to do it because blogs just have a better way of making a connection. Let's check this one out. Daily Forex Trading Blog. Okay, interestingly enough, this one, they do have some links here, but I'm not seeing any banner ads. Now, that's not necessarily a bad thing. Very often, some of the biggest breakthroughs that I've had in my business is whenever I've come across a site like this, a little niche site. Sometimes, the, the crazy thing is sometimes these people don't even realize that they're ranked as high as they are for certain keywords or that they get as much traffic as they do. And so what I'll do is I'll go to these websites and I'll say, hey, would you be okay with me putting a banner ad, let's say, up in this corner right here? You know, I'll pay you $250 um, a month. To, to have that ad there, and we'll, we'll, we'll test it for 30 days. I'll give you $250, put my ad up there for 30 days. If it makes sense for me, I'll keep it. If it makes sense for you, then we'll keep going. Sites that never even had banner advertising, I was able to go to them directly, get an ad on their site that generated, maybe it di didn't generate you know, 10,000 clicks a day, but the clicks that it generated were very targeted, very specific, and converted really, really well. So again, these are just some big, these are just some quick ideas. There's a lot more of them out there, but these are some quick ideas where if you tried banner advertising in the past or if you've tried doing some kind of media buying and it hasn't worked out, it's probably because you paid too much. It's because you didn't know how to go out there, find the individual sites where you want your ads to appear. So that's the big secret of banner advertising today if you have a small budget, all right? If you have all the money to spend in the world, if you got $100,000 to spend, then don't worry about any of this, okay? Go to the big guys. Go to Blue Lit Lithium. Go to Casale. Go to some of the other big banner ad networks out there. They'll do the work for you, and, and you'll be able to, to make it work if you have a really good offer. Um, if you don't have that much money to spend, though, you're going to need to do a little bit more legwork, but you're going to be able to get your ad all over the place, all right? All over the place on tons and tons of websites in your particular market, and you know, you're not going to have to be paying Google. You're going to be getting significantly lower prices because you've cut Google out of the equation completely. So I hope you found this video somewhat helpful, somewhat insightful, and I heavily encourage you to go out and give banner advertising a shot again. And if you're a little bit nervous, if, if you don't want to just dive into this all by yourself, I suggest that you take advantage of the wholesale traffic system while spots are still available because this is going to be a big thing that we're going to be covering, covering in significant depth. So with that, I'll go ahead and finish off, close out this video right now. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you in the wholesale traffic system.